Hi, it's Joe. Welcome to the Quilt Report. Well, here I am in my studio, uh, which has all over the walls quilts that are the result of a collaboration between my friend Luke Haynes and me. And I thought what would be fun would be to uh, do a, uh, a walkthrough here, uh, especially for my YouTube followers. So uh, here we go. I'm just gonna start right over here. Let me flip this camera around and I'll start with this one. This is uh, Luke and me. Uh, I think I was visiting him in Seattle when he lived there. Luke sent me this log cabin type of background and I did surgery on it and then added some bias tape and then he put us on the quilt ha, and quilted it. Here's one called My Own Mountain. Uh, Luke sent me these log cabin blocks and I slammed them all together and uh, made this sort of dog tooth edged mountain there and I showed it to my wife and she said, it needs a mountain climber. So I sent it to Luke and he put a mountain climber on it. Huh. Luke sent me these, uh, this background piece, uh, uh, birds in the air as the design. He pieced it all with uh, used fabric, recycled fabric, and then um, uh, dipped it all in indigo dye and some of the fabrics took the dye differently than other fabrics. So then he sent that to me and I thought birds in the air, huh? Oh yeah, I know what to do with that. So I put birds all over it. Here's one that's just by Luke. We got started on this collaboration by trying to imitate each other's styles. I made a picture of him uh, a portrait of Luke Haynes in his American context is called that's a bias tape portrait of him, which uh, has been sold. We borrowed it back for the opening of this show, but um, uh, it's gone now. And But this is Luke's imitation of my style, where he cut up, he sewed a bunch of clothes together and then cut them up and then cut them into six inch squares and sewed them back together in a way so as to try to keep the clothes originally together. You can see it created this beautiful abstract design. Excellent work, Luke. Up in the front is another uh, one of his indigo dyed uh, backgrounds. He sent me this. Uh, the longer the fabric stayed in the dye bath, the longer, uh, the darker it got. Uh, and then the, uh, so anyway, he made this gradation out of it. Sent it to me uh, last year. And when I was feeling like the world was particularly crazy. So I did this sort of a tear in the, space-time continuum and put that on there. Luke quilted it. Uh, also last year, I think, maybe the year before, uh, Luke sent me these, uh, this background piece. It's made out of uh, uh, kimono pieces. And then I put the, uh, those pine needles on there. Sent it back and he quilted it. <clears throat> also this, uh, he sent me uh, this blue and red freely pieced background piece, and then I chopped it up and did stuff to it to make it look like the background of a Gustav Klimt uh, picture of, it's called a portrait of uh, Fritz Riedler, or Riedler. Um, so I did all that and put her on there, and then Luke uh, not only quilted it, but he um, couched yarn, black yarn, uh, in the this circle teacup kind of pattern. Portrait of Fritza Reidler. So that's our show. Thanks for stopping by. Um, come by anytime. Talk to you again.